I'm gonna teach you how to install a 5 amp server. So what you're gonna do, you're gonna go into the link that I put in the description. You're gonna go to this build, go to the top, download it, find a file you want to put it in. I'll just do one called YC server. Yeah, and then open that, press save, and then you want to open up that file with like WinRAR 7-zip, whatever, and you want to put these files into the folder we just created. Point to server. You're gonna name this server. And then what you're gonna do, you're gonna control A on this and drag and drop. Alright. You could delete this if you want. Close this, open this back up, and then there will be like a pinkish reddish fx server.exe you're gonna open it then press allow and then it will automatically show up the cfx.retx admin just do link account continue and then it will say create a backup password create one Uh, I have read and just click this and then create create master account create password sure so you don't have one press next change this I'll just call it YT server next deployment if you're wanting to do a V menu which I'll do a video on that later you're gonna press popular recipe and then CFX default 5M. Or if you wanna do ESX or QB core, just click on the ones, but we're gonna go with this default one. Then it automatically puts the base, save, go to recipe deployer. This is uh, your deployer, press next. And then you need a license key. So you'll click this green key master link. It's gonna go into this login, sign in. And then if you have a server, use that. But if you don't, uh, press new server, display name. Let's just put YT server, your IP. Uh, uh, there will be a link in the description that is a find my IP, but I'm not going to open it because I don't want to show, show you my IP. I'm just going to blur this one. And server type, you want to put home hosted and you could put home, home hosting again. And then I'm not a robot, and then generate. You're going to copy the key, paste it in here, run recipe. And then a file will open up. That. Press, go back to your browser, press next. And then this is your, like, server.cfg. This is where everything's going to start and stuff. What you're going to do is save and run server. Could not authorize server license key, then it does not exist. Okay. That does not exist. Save file. And restart server. So if you're getting that error, you're gonna go to CFG editor. SV 
underscore license key that's what you're gonna find and put your license key in this um like code then you can restart your server and it should be fine now you see that it's kind of weird c f x dot r e has open this means your server is up so you can minimize everything and then hop on v or 5m and then connect to your desktop on lan let's see server don't mind the cubicore and then that's pretty much it once we load in i'll just show you some stuff but also with your server you're, you'll have resource this is all your files right here I recommend not messing with these if you do you could break your server and then yeah yt server tx data cfx and then resource this is all your plugin scripts whatever now you see this is just the base 5m server absolutely nothing regular gta game so if you want to learn how to install a v menu i will do that after this video teach you how to install it but yeah that's how you install a free 5m home hosted 5m server pretty simple but yeah uh so this is basically the end of the video but i'm gonna talk about something we i have a 5m server called vengeance county roleplay we are just trying to look for members and people to play on the server we have like 400 scripts or something like that but here's our discord this will be in the link of the description uh we have rule stuff basic uh roleplay stuff but yeah I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe so I can make more of these. And if you want, uh, if you have anything in mind, just put it in the comments and I'll uh, like it or do a video on it. But yeah, that's basically it. Uh, so.